Okay, so now we're going to be doing the, uh, the uh, same positioning, but uh, with the Kimura. Now my opponent is able to roll free, and he rolls through it. So say, we do the same thing, I break the grip, I start attacking the Kimura, hit, oh, the Mpala, and now my foot goes and I pull and I get in here. But now he, he starts rolling before I start to get the yank, yanking the hand. So immediately my feet needs to swing over and now I switch my, my hand to be going with Umuplala, kind of like mid-air, because if not, he's going to be starting to be getting through all the way. So the men on the loop is coming up. And he's going to start going all the way, and now it's hard for me to finish. Because he uses the momentum of the roll. So I break, I break, I go, and I go, and I get here. Now, my opponent is rolling. I need to be pulling it fast, and I get my hands immediately here. Now I pull inwards, locking, keeping my thighs tight. Again, I never try and go, like, do armbar like this. It's too much space for him to move. Keep it tight, get it here, and like you, if you have this grip, you switch immediately, and you control, you get the submission. So a little bit faster. So this is a nice little detail to the umpara and if the person is escaping, 